This video will cover one of the troubleshooting steps for calculating aircraft altitude when a fault has occurred through the Collins ProLine 21 system. Use the controls on the CCP to navigate through diagnostics. Note, the key functions will be located at the bottom of the page. Push the database key, then the upper or lower menu key. You will then see the database menu appear. Rotate the data knob to highlight the maintenance main menu. Press the upper menu button to remove the database menu block. From the maintenance main menu, move the joystick down to highlight the aircraft history. Press the select button. From the aircraft history page, highlight the fault history file. Press the select button. From the fault history page, the faults will be identified by ATA codes. Move your joystick and highlight the flight squawk. In this case, the stab miscompare. Notice the fault message gives a date, time, and lets you know if the fault occurred in the air or on taxi. Press the select button. From the advanced diagnostic page, the view detail diagnostic data will be highlighted. Press the select button. From the detail diagnostic page, press the zoom plus key to navigate through the LRU fields. In the upper right corner of the page, you will notice the number of pages available to view. Move the joystick and highlight LRU name PFD1. Press the select button. This is the page where you will calculate the aircraft altitude when the fault occurred. Notice the zeros and ones. You will add all the numbers on the right that have the number 1 next to them. Like this. 4 plus 16 plus 64 plus 256 plus 1024 plus 4096 equals 5,460 feet. And this is how you will find the aircraft's altitude when a fault occurs.